grapefruit? Where the fuck is... This is going to be another Peggle Knights stream, kind of. Anyway, we're going to play the Earl pack today. This is the Earl's Peggle level pack. I got I got sent this in a message. I'm not going to show the first part because it's going to get me copyright struck, but... I'm useless. This is the commercial for the Earl pack. My wife and children. <laughs> I bet you're a pussy! You won't beat them! So that's what we're gonna play today. It's like 10 Peggle levels from Earl. Here they are. Yeah, everyone say thank you, Earl, I guess. Was that fucking Kanjin house? It- it was. Here's Fratelli's Pizza. I think this- the- the scorpion and the fish, I think, are in... Kanjin house, I think. And then, uh, Gino's up here. You got Gino. So I'm just gonna go for, uh, gay sex. Tuesday nights. It's cat little Geno's. I- I have not clicked on a single one of these. I do not know the gimmicks, so... I'm already amused by the little Geno's. Uh, so it's been a while. Instantly I go for, uh... Hat ball because it's the best fucking power up. Okay, well, I assume the Geno's have collision. Very nice. And yet again, the hat ball demonstrates its innate superiority to basically every other power-up. Getting a free ball on points alone that early on. Some people have asked, they've been like, oh, what the fuck do you mean? What are you talking about, Kanjin? Relatively obscure. Kind of sad that it's relatively obscure. Uh, YouTube content creator. He makes, like, animations and voiceover things. I think he's a very funny guy. Isabel's like a huge fan and made me like binge watch the entire- he has this series called Kanjin House. Where it's just a fucking like- it's just a stupid like JPEG of him talking a lot of the time. But I swear to god it's actually funny. Oh, uh, hello, is this Fratelli's Pizza? Yes, it is. Is this Kanjin? Yeah! What are you doing, Gino? Why did you hang up on me? Because I hate you. If you have, uh, there's there's a lot of like pushback against like loud humor, and like I get it. Whoa, the Genos are portals. What? <laughs> it got absorbed into his gun. Nice. One sec. I, I keep having to like snort. So I don't think I can make something come out of that Geno, sadly. But I could make something come out of this one, potentially. Or out of this one, rather. Let's try this. No, that also comes out of the spaghetti. Fuck you. Aw, oh, fuck you. I hate Kanjin House. Worst show I've ever watched. No, that's not actually true. And I I'm actually gonna... So, a while ago I raided Kanjin and I was like, Oh, Bella will like lose her shit. Because I, I was like, oh, Kanjin's streaming for like 40 viewers. Like... I bet we could get, like, a little shout-out, and, uh, Bella would, like, would freak out. And he messaged me afterward, and he was like, Yo, do you want, do you want me to just, like, record? I can just record, like, a short little thing to, uh, like, just a little recording, like, of, like, the characters or whatever for her. So, for, like, all, like, five Conjin viewers who are watching this, probably more, we, we have exclusive lore. Hello, it's me, Conjin, just dropping by to say hi to Bella. Starts Hello. out pretty normal. Uh, the grapefruit. Kind of boring. Uh, raided my chat because he wanted. He said you were a fan. He said you freak out. I figured it'd probably be cooler if I just said hi instead of that. So this is why Get I'm here. Mine. Give me that. Who are you calling? I was talking to Isabel. That's Gina. Bella, but we are know. calling from prison. This is our only phone call. Who the fuck is Isabel? Well, if I had to describe her in one word, I would choose stranger. What? You? You? Well, Isabel, I hope you fall in a hole so deep they have your funeral in Beijing. I'll kill you. Do you know it was talk like that that got us in here in the first place? Maybe chill out. Hello. It's oh, what it cut off his? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hold on, hold on. Can we get that again? Can we get that in the first place? Maybe chill out. Hello. Yeah, there we go. 
the the famous his famous like jowl noise. And it was very cool of him to do that. Very chill. Seems like a cool guy. He said he also said in the DM he was like, "Yo, if you want to do anything, uh, just let me know." I, I have no fucking idea what that entails. I I don't know how to cash in on that. Okay, I gotta beat this fucking level. Very cool. Thank you, Kanjin. And that's what this dumb little fucking guy is from, with the cigar in his mouth. Fireball! That's actually not bad at all. For this stage, I'll take it. I think we got it. I think we got something decent. Magic hat on top of the fireball. Holy shit. Why is the fireball sound still playing? I can still hear the, like, there's a fireball in the, in the chamber sound. Is that a glitch? Oh, sorry. Feature of the Earl pack. I bet you're a pussy. You won't beat them. Someone said my brain is just a stationary JPEG of Gino. Uh, the game looks a little, like, blurry. It's not really that big of an issue. It just looks a little... Bl it, it doesn't look as crisp as it does on my screen. We're not gonna be able to see this gay sex in HD glory. Yeah, I'm the streamer who showed gay sex on Twitch. Oh, 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 thank God. Uh, yeah, this is actually kind of scary, uh... Okay. Thank you. You should ruin your connections to other people. Yeah, that's absolutely right. I have conquered gay sex. I fucking love wine. Oh, this Peggle level was made by Earl. I bet is what it's trying to communicate. This just reminds me of one of the, uh, Jimmy Lightning levels in this game. Oh, that's hot. Uh, now, Earl, did you figure out a way to make slides work in this game? In, like, modded Peggle? Because huge ups to Earl. It seems like they're fine. Maybe even, like, blocks were just, like, copy-pasted or something? I don't know. Damn. Oh! That's an obstacle! <laughs> that's an obstacle! I didn't know that was gonna bounce the ball, I was so sad. It's... Very cool. Very cool. Shit, I I, I kind of wasn't thinking. I kind of wanted the full clear, but whatever. <clears throat> Aced. Fucking destroyed. Take that, Earl. Ball pincher. Someone said I just realized the particles are Mario. <laughs> That, that ain't Mario. That ain't even Luigi. I wonder where, like, the edge of this object is. Jesus fucking Christ. People ask, is it a curse being a Peggle legend at times? And, uh... No, it's basically only a good thing. It's fucking awesome. Come on. Come on. Yeah, yeah, that's it. That's the one. That's the one. That's the one. Still got it. That's the one. Way worse score than the other one. <laughs> Alright, it's about to go. Yeah. The gas leak. There's a gas leak in my house. <laughs> You're just gonna hear like... That was way too like... Re that was way too loud of a thump. You're just gonna like... I'm just gonna collapse at a certain point. Fuck. That was all planned. Okay, okay. Nice. Well, now I have to do a rim shot, and that's just the way it is. I don't make the rules. <laughs> I don't- I don't like you looking at me like that, Earl. Oh, right, fuck this. You guys just hit it. Just hit it. My secret desire to be a Foley artist. I would actually love to do Foley work. Doesn't that sound like an unbelievably fun job? Uh, to anybody who doesn't know, Foley is just making sound effects for things. Doesn't that sound awesome? You get to be the guy with the big sheet of aluminium. Going... Did I see Earl in chat? Sorry, I keep having to snort. Okay, what the fuck is this one? Dear God, uh, they're moving so fast, it's giving me anxiety. I can't peg like this. <laughs> That's awful. 
fuck you. It like fucks with the momentum. No, hit the little purple thing, you dick. Kinda wanna see how much this fucks with the Zen Ball. I, I don't know. Zen Ball would probably have some trouble here. As we all know at this point, 100%ing Peggle levels, to a certain degree, is, is just fucking trial and error, and just slamming your head into a wall until you get lucky. There is, you know, I like to think I'm a pretty good Peggle player at this point. Oh yeah. But, uh... There is a lot of luck involved, unless you're like an actual Tass. Didn't even go where I thought it would go. Let's try it, let's try the Zen Ball. I can't imagine much else. Uh, you know, weirdly enough, Splork actually might not be the worst here. It would get like most of Patrick's face. Let's not do it right now though. Let's, let's do this. I'm curious. What if we get like a legendary shot? Uh, my, my classic gambit... No, it's not gonna be very good, I don't think. My classic gambit with the, uh, the Zen Ball is... Whoa. It's still going, actually. It's actually doing pretty good now. Goddamn. Okay, you know what? I should've shut my fat fucking mouth. Get me another free ball, you slut. Yeah! Oh, that was actually awesome! Thank you, Zen Ball. The strat with Zen Ball... It tries to hit the purple peg. Like, no matter where you aim it, it tries to hit the purple peg. Uh, so, just aim it at the purple peg, and then it will make minute adjustments. It, it's like, it tries to get as many points as possible by, like, calculating fucking, like, Doctor Strange, seeing all the possible futures or whatever, I think. Something like that. It tries... It prioritizes hitting the purple one. So if you just hit the purple one first, then it will, uh... It will be smarter. It will, like, be more efficient, basically. Because it won't be factoring in the purple peg at all. It'll just be like, what angle do I bounce off the purple peg at that will best get as many points as possible? Also, it bounced off one of these little, like, scrumblos and, like, didn't even do anything. It didn't even activate the peg. Because this shit is busted. And I hit the purple peg, it will decide the best angle. It will divine. Very nice. You know what? Zen Ball was actually fucking great. Try to uh, get a free ball here. That worked. Better than I thought it would. Last ball. I'm not fucking around. <laughs> I'm not fucking around. <laughs> no way. That was a that was a once in a lifetime opportunity. Zen Ball actually. Uh, man, this shit clears. No cap. The hat ball. It will. It will always be the goat. Held back only by... Whoa. Was that a teleport? I'm sorry, does Luigi just instantly kill you? Does, like, Dark Luigi instantly end your turn? <laughs> oh, and the counter is in, like, the foreground. Look at how the bucket is interacting with that. Okay, I, I can't aim at the purple peg, so... We're just gonna do this. <laughs> oh! Oh, that was some nutty stuff. If that, if that had gone in the bucket, that would have been crazy. I, I don't think the Zen Ball actually factors in the bucket at all, though. Nice. Free ball, even when I couldn't even fucking see it. Born. And yes, I'll take every opportunity to say this. That sound effect is in Doom. Yeah, I'm pretty sure, uh, is it like the, the fish, like, spits it out or something? If you, if you slam into Luigi's face there? What is happening with the Luigi? Wow, wow, wow. I, I'm curious. Hold on. No, it, it just like fucking kills. I, I don't know why I'm like fucking around here. <laughs> There's some more of those awesome Earl mechanics. I think uh, these things are like fucking with the speed of the ball. They're like hyper bouncy in the same way that some of Bobby Joe's levels were. That's what's making it go so insane. Reveal the banger. <laughs> this is like some shitty tweet about Dave Matthews' band. And <laughs> I need to clear it away breakout style. 
Wait. That's just a solid wall? Do I just get to win? Ooh. Two hundred. Two million. One million. Reveal the banger. <laughs> no way this clears in one shot. I already missed that one brick over on the uh, left. And these two on the right are gonna make trouble for me as well. Well, uh, this is fun. I wish the purple peg had been like one of the first ones I hit. <laughs> this is, this is like 2009 internet speed. Like an image is loading in like 2009. God, that was good. And now we have the fireball locked and loaded. Oh, and then I fucked it up. And I fucked it up. Let's try to like... Whoa, what? The, the, like the like counter? What What did it bounce off? Oh no. Hold on, Earl's head? Earl's head is an obstacle. Oh no. <laughs> that one is gonna be tricky to get, that orange peg that's right under Earl's fucking gormless head. Uh, I tried to like, I tried to like squip it through there, you know? Come on. <laughs> Come on. Just like dissolve down. There you go. Like the acid in Alien. Sheesh! That was fucking awesome. It's still going. It's still going. <laughs> That was a lot of- that was a lot of points. <laughs> reveal the banger. Cause not only do we need to clear the level, we need to d reveal the banger. Like, we need to see what the tweet is. I can read most of it. Come on. Yep. No. Wrong. Okay, good. Right. Correct. Alright, alright. Me, listening to my Dave Matthews CD in the car. Man, I love Dave Matthews Band. My wife in the passenger seat who just ingested enough tranquilizer to concuss an elephant. When's the molly gonna hit? Oh my god. Ultra combo off the retweet button. Is it gonna stop? Is it gonna stop? Come on. Into the bucket you go. Oh, that was a banger. Whee! Oh no, there's a death Luigi in this one. <laughs> this is like somebody bounced. This is from some video, isn't it? I feel like I've seen this. This is a bam, 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 bam. You know, gotta pay respect to the greats. The goat, the flippers. Fuck off. Oh! Come on, the flippers might actually be, uh,. Decent. Whoa. What? No, 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 not the Luigi. I bet you're a pussy. You won't beat them. Oh, oh no, Luigi. What? That's the riff that makes me feel like I'm losing my mind, by the way. Come on, get the rest of them. Tougher than the rest of them. My name is Duckles, and I constantly chuckle. It is like my defining character trait in the first game that I appeared in. Come on. Make it work. Now, get the other one. Please. Spinman, please. Spinman, please. Spinman is not gonna... He's not gonna help me out here. No! The trampoline is gone! No! 10k! I, I love that, like, it's... The, the death Luigi is just, like, a mechanic. That's the awesome Earl mechanic. Nice. Oh my god, Zenball. Zenball, you are so sexy today. Oh my Jesus, fuck. Just makes me wish I could see the level. Well, we got it. Oh my god. It never gets old being this good at Peggle. It never gets old. It feels good every time. Grout. Grout! <laughs> what, what am I- what am I seeing here? What am I looking at? 
Hey, you know what? Fucking very Jimmy Lightning. Do your do your worst, Jimmy. Oh, Jimmy, uh, as usual, you fucking suck. The shit does not clear. This shit sucks. Jimmy. Jimmy. Nah. Uh -huh. All intentional. It's exactly what I wanted to happen. Minus the fucking flower power. Another awful ability. That's why the hat ball's so good. Hat ball clears. Sheesh. Ba -ba -bo -ba 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 -ba. Shut the fuck up. Oh! Oh! Still going. Oh, all according to plan. It never gets old being this good. <laughs> okay, and now I'm gonna lose. No, I win. Fuck you, grout. Fucking Sean. Sean's such a fucking tryhard dick. You know that? Slop. Okay, wise guy, you try eating the slop. <laughs> There's little flies. Eat the slop. Bucket of wet slop. Grin. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was such a little. That was such a pathetic little noise I just made. <laughs> the flies are currently li the the like the bullies. On the, on the playground that have my hat and they're like passing it around to each other. I'm like, give it back! Come on! Guys! Not funny! <laughs> my beanie propeller hat! <laughs> Guys, give me back my propeller beanie! Please! <laughs> Beanie propeller. Man, I gotta get me one of those. That's like infinite power in a hat. <laughs> I keep, okay, uh, I keep being like against my will forced to see images of celebrities at like big events. The Met Gala. I'd love to go to the Met Gala on one condition. If I can wear <laughs> like a pocket protector, <laughs> nerd glass. See, the thing is, I'd fit right in. This, I think this is a funny, silly idea, but I would fit right in. I want, like, the rainbow propeller beanie, like, nerd glasses with, like, tape in the middle, and a pocket protector. And, like, khakis with, like, a white button-down shirt tucked in tight. It's, like, really saddening. Oh! 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 Why did I go for that? Okay, whatever. The Met Gala is fun to make fun of, but I feel like even that, like, it's just so, like... It's just so depressing. <laughs> uh, celebrity culture is so fucked, isn't it? Like, I'm not stupid, right? Like, it's fucked. Like, I'm not making too big of a deal out of this or anything. You know why so many celebrities are psychos? Because of shit like this. <laughs> like... Because they're given, like, this much- Like, I would fucking, like, lose my mind and dissolve into a small beaker of, of sulfuric acid if I was given that much- Like, if people gave that much of a shit about what dumb thing I wore to some- Like, what even is the Met Gala? Does anybody here know what it is? What is it? It's just, like, a ball for rich people? I, like, huh? Huh? But you see what I'm saying? How it's like, it's exhausting even to like talk about, like, even if you're like being a hater. It's like a classic thing to be like, oh, you know, like people in like high art, they're just fucking around. They're just like making up bullshit. But a lot of like high fashion stuff, I really feel that way about. Where it's like, they've, they've sincerely run out of like normal clothing ideas. And are now on like the random wacky bullshit spectrum like forever like they can't go back there's like there's been like fashion like high fashion power creep takes lives all right i put this i put this shot in the hand of, i put this shot in the hand of the fly the fly fucking sucks you say that but you enjoy jojo now i am gonna go out on a limb here i'm gonna say something that might be a little controversial might be a little strange, might upset some people. I'm gonna go ahead and say that real life 
and JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, the manga slash anime series by Hirohiko Araki, are like kind of different. A little bit, at least. Might upset some people, might offend. <laughs> might, might be a little bit of a hot take there. A little bit spicy, we're getting a little spicy here. I'm gonna go, go ahead and say that real life is not JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Why live? <laughs> Why live? JoJo's isn't real life. Why fucking live? Might as well just end it now. Damn it. These fucking flies. I hate it. I hate it. I'm gonna reset again. I've been thinking a lot about this whole, like, celebrity thing. And this is- this is a very, like, like, this is a very cringe start to a sentence. But I- I had a hit tweet. I had a hit tweet, guys, that got, like, 50k likes or whatever. And it's like, man... Like, I knew... I- I knew what it would be like. Like, I- I could have imagined that, like, what it would be like having, like, a, a huge tweet like that with, like, a bunch of people responding to it and shit. Like, I know, I've been on the internet quite a while. But it just, it just was another reminder that, like, I, I never want to have, like, a huge-ass, like, unbelievably large audience. Because it's, like, in order to function when you have that large of, like, a fandom or whatever, like, if every tweet I posted had that many responses to it, I just feel like I would just, like, stop giving a shit about what anyone had to say. And I want to give a shit about what people say. Even if they're, like, haters, even criticize, e even criticisms. You know? Because it's like so many celebrities get, like, the anything-proof shield, you know, where, like... They just don't give a shit about anything that's said about them, and that's how you lead- that's how you lead to, like, celebrity psychos. That's how you get, like, Will Smith. Is, like, people who have been- People who have heard so many responses to- whoa. To the things that they've said, that they just don't give a shit anymore, and- and it's like... Even valid criticism is- they're just immune to it, you know? Yeah, empathy be gone. Basically, and like, uh, people ask a lot of the time, like, why don't you advertise your stream, like, basically at all? Like, you could, you have so many YouTube followers, like, you could, you could get so much viewership on Twitch if you just, like, advertised your channel a bit. And it's like, man, I don't want, like, Jerma's chat, where I, like, lose my fucking, like, sense of self. Because there's so many people in it, like, calling me a fucking loser or whatever, I don't know. The fly. The fly. The fly! <laughs> It actually worked out. Do it again, fly. <laughs> Somebody said I want to be immune to criticism. That's, I feel like that's, and, and, okay, this is gonna be like a really dickish thing to say. I feel like that's like a bottom of the bell curve, like, thing to say. Like, no, you want, like, it's, it's good to be able to accept criticism. Like, like a lot of times, like, you'll see something where somebody's like hating on you for whatever reason. And like, it, sometimes they're right. Sometimes they're fucking right. Sometimes they have a perfectly valid point. It, sometimes even people who are, like, super angry have a reason to be angry with you. I, like, I don't- I don't want the anything proof shield. I don't want it. Get it away from me. I- I, I want to be able to accept criticism. And I know people will be like, oh, great for you, never accept criticism. I, I kinda- I do. Like, it's just, like... The ones, the ones you don't see me contest are often things where I'm like, yeah, I agree with that. I feel like shit now. But like in a good way. I don't know. Yeah, it's like you should be capable of change. That's a good thing. It's a good thing to, to get criticized in a way. Not always. Plenty of times people have the, the dumbest, and you guys, you know, probably see me in the comments of VODs every once in a while. Somebody will like be hating on me for like the dumbest fucking thing, and I will defend myself. In situations where, not all the time, but some of the time when I'm just like, fuck this, like, I don't want to be accused of something that is just like, I don't know. Like, I don't want people to think just untrue things about me, but a lot of times people say something where like, wow, I really like acted like an asshole in this situation or whatever. I'm like, yeah, I feel bad about that. Like, I should be able to take that and like try to improve my behavior for the future. That's good. 
Earl is live tweeting your stream. <laughs> oh. This is not even to mention. Like, celebrities are one thing. This is not even to mention, like, trolls, you know? People who, like, just try to get negative attention all the time. That's, like... That's like the six times more powerful anything proof shield, and that's super, that, that's so harmful. That is so fucked. Let's go to Earl Twitter. Let's see. Let's see what Earl Twitter has to say about this. He said, it begins with like a, a gif of lightning. I, I, there, you got me. I said gif. Then he said, you're welcome. Then he said, clearly this guy has never eaten, open quotes, slop. And 17 seconds ago, he said, you may have won the Battle Grapefruit, but you haven't won the war. And he posted a crypt wizard. Whatever the fuck that means. <laughs> I know the strength of Earl's flies. I think that's all the levels, right? Yeah, that's all Earl levels. Do we want to... I don't know, some of them were kind of like, they had fun mechanics. You know, let's do the... I... <sighs> I feel, I feel like Reveal the Banger has, like, super good potential for, like, a one-shot clear. Who the fuck is Earl? Dude, I don't know. I do not know. Like, I feel like just, like, throw, like, infinite monkeys type strategy here, you know? Infinite typewriters, infinite monkeys. I mean, did I instantly nail it? I feel like I instantly nailed it. No, it didn't get those on this side, though. This is hot, though. This one is really funny. Earl, these were very funny, in all seriousness. These were very cool levels. I liked the Earl mechanics, they were awesome. And, uh, it made me laugh a lot. Thank you for making this. Let me just try multi-ball on it, I just, I'm kinda curious. Oh, right at the top, too. Oh my god, Newton would be so proud. Okay, well that fucking sucked, as is- as is the norm for Jimmy ne I almost said Jimmy Neutron, Jimmy Lightning. This one's gonna be hard to sneak into there. Sneak it in like Mr. Krabs sneaking me down his urethra. Whoa! Hot? Oh... Uh, it, it could still work, but the one on the right I'm very skeptical about. Oh, triple play! Yeah, no way we're getting a full clear here, but... Damn, that was weird. <laughs> Days without Mr. Krabs urethra mention. Zero. Thank you again, Earl. This was genuinely... These were very cool. Uh, I'm always shocked with these uh, level packs. I have beaten your challenge.